Hello, welcome to the Soul Print Positive Energy Circle. So for those of you who are seeing this on Sunday when it's released, um, this coming Wednesday, so I think it's the 22nd, is Earth Day. So that's why I'm here and that's why we have the beautiful, you know, tree of life behind me. Um, and I thought this would be absolutely, of course, the most perfect time in the world to do another healing energy circle for the planet. So, you know, so it's interesting because we've done a few of them lately and, and it's really important to do because energetically, as the earth has been able to sort of hit this pause button and, you know, things have settled and the skies are clearing and the water is clearing and um, the earth has started, it stopped shaking and vibrating. Um, it's as if the earth is finally able to just take a deep breath and, and sort of, I'm not going to go so far as to say regenerate herself, but I am going to say at least take a step back from flat out exploding. So um, that's what this um, positive energy circle is about today. And so let's just go ahead. And of course, certainly if you're, you know, doing this today and you would like to do it again on Wednesday, um, that would be brilliant and wonderful. Definitely. Um, as I said before, it really doesn't matter when or how often you um, do the video and you do the meditation connected to the energy circle, because that energy and that prayer literally connects with like energies everywhere in the universe. And so there is never, ever a time that you are doing it by yourself. Okay, so that's always like really important to keep in mind because there is no such thing as sort of missing the moment. Okay, so here we go. Let's take a deep breath in and out. Get nice and comfortable now. Settle into where you're ever you're sitting or laying and take another deep breath in and out. Continue that rhythmic breathing. And as you do, your body recognizes the relaxation signal. And you can just feel your body just kind of letting go of any stress or tension, fear or anxiety. And we're all carrying a lot of that these days. And so it's so welcoming to just feel that energy dissipate and drift away. Your eyes, if they have not already closed, are going to flutter closed. And with another deep breath in, one, two, three, four, and an exhale, one, two, three, four, five, six. You're just going to settle into that deep, deep sense of relaxation, comfort, and safety. You absolutely have all the time in the world. And should there be a sharp or sudden noise, whether your environment or on this video, you will hear it and acknowledge it, but it will not disturb you. It will not startle you so that you continue to stay in that really, really relaxed, comfortable, safe place. And you're just going to continue to sink in. You may feel like you're swinging on a hammock, or maybe you're going to feel like you're floating on water. Perhaps you're going to feel like you're just safe and cocooned in, in, in warmth and blankets. Whatever this sensation, those or any other, they're so 
welcome. So, so welcome. It is so nice to be able to release, release, release. Let the anxiety go. Let the clutter go. You can feel your entire body simply relaxing, just relaxing. That beautiful, peaceful energy is moving from your toes up your legs to the knees, up your thighs into the hips. So relaxed, so relaxed. All of your body feels completely relaxed. You're just acknowledging that as you move forward, the energies just relax even more and your body just lets go. And so now there's no tension in your pelvic area or your tummy. There's no tension in your tummy. You're completely relaxed. Your heart feels just a wee bit lighter. And that energy moves through your from your shoulders down all the way to your fingertips. It comes back and I feel that energy circling your neck. You can feel the tension leaving your neck and your shoulders. And that peaceful, calm, relaxing energy all the way down your spine. So comfortable, so relaxed, so peaceful. And that energy now moves into your head, your face. You can feel your jaw relaxing, your cheekbones. Even your eyelids feel just a little bit heavier. Any stress in your forehead, dissipated, gone. And for just this one moment in time, you have great clarity and great understanding of how wonderful the earth feels right now as things have calmed. And the air is less polluted. The water is clearing. You can see farther because there's no heavy pollution in the way. The energy and the earth has slowed and it's not vibrating, it's not shaking. It's calm and it's peaceful. You now understand the earth, how the earth is feeling right now, right in this moment. And in your mind's eye or in your imagination, you're going to carry that energy with you as you create before you a picture of the planet Earth. A picture of the place we all reside in and call home. It is masses of green and blue and white. There are snow caps at the poles, and there is green and brown energy everywhere land masses, and grass, and fields, and orchards. And those incredible oceans and rivers, lakes and waterways, all shimmering blue. Various shades and tones of blue. Some are light and gentle, some are deep and gray, but it's all on the spectrum. And you feel such feeling of love and appreciation for the planet you live on and you are filled with gratitude that one of the few rainbows that we have found as we experience this pandemic is that the earth has finally been given some quiet and some peace 
And it can also, with you, take a deep breath in. Now, holding that picture of that beautiful earth in your mind's eye or in your imagination, or perhaps if you're not really visual, you might just see or hear the word earth or planet, and that's okay too, and that works perfectly. I want you to surround that image with sparkly, twinkly lights. Like almost like the bursts of firecrackers, like, like fireworks, these beautiful shimmery colors that sh light up and glow. I want you to see the earth surrounded by those incredible lights and twinkles. But unlike fireworks, they don't fade. They stay suspended around the entire planet, these incredible, incredible lights. They are white. Some of them are pink and blue. Some of them are lavender and green. Some of those twinkling, amazing lights are pure white. Some of them are gold and silver. Some of them are a dark royal blue or a, a, a royal purple or a brilliant red or an emerald green. However you see them and whatever colors they are, they continue to, to twinkle and they are just dancing around the earth. And I want you to, to magnify them. I want you to make them as big and as bright as you can because in a moment with love and with healing energy we are going to release the suspension and they are all going to gently drift to the earth they're going to move from the atmosphere to the sky and they're slowly going to drift down to the earth, to the land, to the water. And as those incredible lights, see them now, see them now, they're falling gently and very, very slowly as they move towards and closer and closer to the planet and the land masses and the oceans. They are being absorbed right into the soul and the depth of the planet itself. That energy is healing. It is balancing. We are sending that loving, powerful, healing energy of gratitude, appreciation, respect, deep, deep into the planet, deep into the earth, so that the earth can hold that energy that energy will help keep it strong. That energy will allow continual healing as things slowly open up again and there's more movement. And our thought and our intention is that even as there is renewed activity. There is also human understanding and wisdom that that activity must, must always be balanced 
with gratitude, with growth, and with protection. We thank the earth for all that she provides, which is everything. It is absolutely everything that we have and we experience in our lives. It's because we are on the earth. It is because we take from the earth. And this is our way. And not the only way, but one of the ways in which we give back. We send our gratitude. We send our healing energy. We send our love. And we also send out into the world. We join, literally join with Mother Earth and Father Sky and send out into the world the wish and the intention that wisdom, moderation, rejuvenation, balance. Have a stronger place and position so that we and the earth are able to sustain life. I want you to focus now on that gentle breathing. And with every breath in, you yourself are absorbing beautiful, healing, loving energy. You're taking that energy and you are absorbing it for yourself so that going forward, you, your vessel is full. So that going forward, you can continue to do the work that you need to do, whether that is physical, mental or emotional, or spiritual. And with every exhale, you release a little bit more worry and a little bit more anxiety. So you inhale the beautiful, brilliant light and exhale any of the lower vibrations that have been trapped in your body and your mind. As you continue that wonderful breath in and out, you're going to become just a little bit more aware of your surroundings. You're feeling perhaps a floating or drifting. It's going to return to the feeling of just simply being very comfortable wherever it is you are sitting or laying. You're going to start hearing the, the noises, the ambient noises in your own environment. Perhaps there's a clock ticking, or perhaps you can hear a bird chirping outside. Whatever it is, it's bringing you back closer to the earth, closer to your current place and reality. But as you return, you carry with you that incredible, incredible, powerful energy and those wonderful feelings of connection to the planet and connection to each other. When I count to three, you're going to open your eyes and you're going to have the energy, the focus and the vitality to move forward with your day. And if by chance you are doing this energy circle in the evening hours and it's time for you to drift off into sleep time, you're gently, gently going to drift off into wonderful, peaceful healing sleep and gentle dreams, awakening 
with vitality, energy, clarity, and focus. One. Two. You can actually feel your eyes starting to flutter. And three. We have done another amazing and wonderful healing for our planet, for Earth, for Gaia. And so I thank you very, very much for continuing to support this incredibly incredible community that we are building here at the Soulprint Energy Circle. Um, it's wonderful. And I, just a quick reminder, if any of you feel like maybe you're not receiving all of the videos that are being released, please make sure that you're subscribed and hit that little bell so that you will receive a notification when the video, this video or any of the other videos are released. Enjoy the celebration of Earth Day. and take a moment for gratitude. Your wonderful, powerful beings of light, always remember that and always embrace it. Bye for now.